Hey guys, Marcus here. In the next few minutes, I'm going to talk about the Quick Setup menu. You open the Quick Setup menu by right or long clicking the Add Map Comp button. Here you have some options. The first one is Create Controller Map Comp. This would create a map comp that would actually don't download imagery. An example for this will come up in a minute. The second one, Create Land Mask Map Comp. That's pretty cool, so let me show you this. I'll create a composition. Call this Land Mask. And click the Create Land Mask Map Comp. This actually creates a Luma Land Mask and links it to the map comp that was selected before. So that's pretty cool. I'm going to switch this off, go to my containing comp, put the land mask on top and use it as a luma mat. And this will now, of course, automatically be animated. So if we zoom in, our mask is just linked to this. And you can now easily do things like this. I'm going to just draw a shape here to highlight Spain. Put this one on top and again say Luma Mat and mask it to the land. Pretty useful. But I'll remove this for now and show you the third button. Create 3D Landscape. So this will actually create a set of map comps that will create this beautiful 3D landscape that is actually rendered with Trapcode Mirror Two. GLS created this project folder. There you have the 3D landscape. You get a height map and a texture map. Both of those you can find in the 3D landscape composition. There's also a mirror layer where you can set up all its properties. You get a camera and you get a little camera rig, which is the tilt and the height null layer. And we have a control map comp in here. The texture and the height map map comp are linked to our control map comp. So by scrolling around here, we can scroll our 3D landscape. Have a look at the rotation properties of the tilt layer. So with this one, you can tilt your camera. With the height layer, you can raise the camera's height and change the Z rotation for the angle that we look at. If you want to draw features on this map, select the texture comp and draw it. Like this it will be correctly displaced on the mirror layer. Whereas for labels you should use the control layer since it is in the 3D landscape composition. Depending on the height that this landscape is displaced you should adapt the labels height. Also if you want to scroll around or jump to a certain location you should use the control layer. In this way, you can create photorealistic animation based on real-world data. That's it for the quick setup. You can now create controller map comps, you can create Luma land masks, and you can set up 3D landscapes. Have a great day, bye!